Hey everyone, it's Mike here, and I just wanted to do a quick follow-up video on the little Flywoo Firefly uh, 1S a Nano Baby. Uh, in my last video, you might have seen that uh, I liked this quite a bit, but I was having a little bit of uh, vibration at low RPM, which I just attributed to my particular set of my motors and props. But a very helpful viewer actually pointed out that there's a mistake in the setup of this version. 1.2 out of the box, in that the uh, number of uh, motor poles or motor magnets is set up incorrectly for the bidirectional uh, ESC. So out of the box, this is set up for 14 poles or 14 magnets, and these motors actually have uh, 12 poles or 12 magnets. And actually, I'm surprised it flew as well as it did, considering that setting is off. So you can change that pretty easily in beta flight. And uh, there's also a dynamic notch uh, with filter setting that you can change. And uh, once I did change these things, I did still have a little bit of vibration at low RPM, but this vibration band was much smaller, and overall, I think it was flying quite a bit better with these settings. So changing those things is uh, pretty straightforward if you have the version 1.2. So let's uh, go ahead and do that now in beta flight. Okay, so in my case, my version has already been uh, changed, but I'll show you where the uh, changes are made. So the first one is the... Uh, configuration here and if you scroll down to right here ESC slash motor feature and then from the out of the box is this number here will be at 14 uh, which is incorrect it should be set at 12 so you just set uh, minus to 12 and then save and reboot and then the other thing that uh, is suggested to change is in the filter settings so you go to the pit tuning tab and we'll go over here to filter settings and the one that you want to change is right here the dynamic notch width so it comes as eight and this should be zero so let's save that and then uh, disconnect so that's all you have to do to uh, update this to the proper bi-directional deep shot settings and also the dynamic notch so let me show you a quick edit of a uh, couple of the flights i had today using the new settings and it's flying better than ever goodbye <laughs>